Making news around the world and here at home, multiple busloads of local Sikhs will be in San Francisco this weekend to make their voices heard. What's the issue? We'll let 17's Robert Price explain. It's almost election day. Punjab election day, that is. This weekend, hundreds of Bakersfield Six will go to San Francisco to cast their ballots. It's for a non-binding global referendum on whether 120 million citizens of India and neighboring Pakistan should be allowed to go their separate way and create the independent nation of Khalistan. This is an advisory vote, but it is not a token vote. An estimated 250,000 members of the Sikh religion, that's the dominant faith of the Punjabi people, live in California. And Bakersfield is home to the state's third largest concentration. The referendum is taking place across America, Europe, and throughout the world. The Indian government, however, is not inclined to grant independence should the vote call for it. They don't want to be us to be separate, right? So they want sex to be with them, and uh, but we don't want it. And there, it's just not about that. There are many, many reasons. Among the reasons, decades of religious and political persecution that in 1984 alone led to the murder of between 6,000 and 17,000 Sikhs, virtually all of them young men. And India's ruling Hindu nationalist government has more recently demonstrated a willingness to act violently on its opposition, at least based on Canadian and U.S. intelligence. A prominent Sikh activist based in British Columbia was shot and killed last June, and another activist based in New York was targeted. Consequently, more than a dozen Bakersfield Sikhs declined to talk about the referendum on camera. One exception was this local Punjabi man who said voter turnout from Bakersfield will be noteworthy. We need a separate country, the Khalistan. That's why the people are ready to go over there. So we have a lot of people here going by the bus in San Francisco. In South Bakersfield, Robert Price, 17 News.